welcome back to my page so this video is about how to run photoshop on your android phone so download these two files the link can be found in the description so after downloading the file make sure you install zect archiver or anyhow you call it so after installing this app you launch the apps and go to download that is where you can find the two files we downloaded earlier so you locate these two files and extract them so this is the first one so you click on it click on extract here so when extraction is done we move to the next one and extract that one also they are all zip files so you need to extract them okay so done so watch carefully this is what you'll be doing next you click on the file as you see you cut this one you hold you press and hold click on cut get back and go to android open obb and paste it there so you can see so go back and install this app go to downloads and open the exagia and install the exagia app you just click on install so let's wait for this app to install so after it has been installed you open the app So this is how it looks when you open. So you click on the three lines at the top left corner there. You go to manage containers. You click on the plus sign. So you click on the three lines, the three dots, sorry. You go to properties, change the color depth to 32 bit, and also check this. So you go to back. Now you click on the three lines there and you run the explorer. So let's wait. Sorry, let's wait for the explorer to run. Okay. So this is how. So you locate Photoshop. So you double click on it or you double tap the setup file there it's going to launch the setup file for the photoshop we are about to run or install so you click on ok all right so you click on next As you can see welcome to adobe photoshop so just click on next and you accept the agreement tap next tap next again tap next and you check create a desktop icon and tap next so the license key is what you are seeing on the screen so just type the license key into the bar over there and click on next so that is the license key i have inputted it so i just have to click on next and click on install so let's wait a bit for this to finish with the installation process So you're almost down with the installation so you click on finish so I click on finish just minimize or close this folder just find a way to you can use your two fingers to pinch it and zoom down or zoom up so 
you close it and you double click or you press and hold and launch the photoshop app you are seeing on the desktop there yeah it's taking a bit long to launch so let's just have patience for this and wait for it to launch it's actually processing so here is it it has launched and um initiating and installing some tools I think we are very close okay so voila here is our photoshop so you can use this to edit anything you want like the way you edit on your computer or desktop anything so to add a workspace you just have to click on file you tap on new and this will pop up just like how it's used on your desktop computer so you can edit this click on ok and that is it a workspace to be created immediately so this is how it looks like you can use it just like um, the one on the desktop as I said earlier so these are the tools you can use it perfectly and make your design or whatever you want to do with the Photoshop up so this is just a few ways to run Photoshop on your Android. Now, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and turn on the post notification for more similar content. We'll talk more.